there everybody welcome back to my channel today I am opening number eight too much glare there and this is the advent calendar for um, my sister and her husband uh, Roxanne and Randy and so today's clue says eight is a Fibonacci number so I didn't know what a Fibonacci number was so I had to look it up and here's what a Fibonacci number is if you don't know so you start off with zero, and then the next number is one. Zero plus one equals one. One plus one equals two. Two plus one equals three. Three plus two equals five. Five plus three equals eight. Eight plus five equals 13. So it's taking those last two numbers, adding them together to get the next number. Isn't that cool? I love patterns like that, but I didn't know that one. So there are also little clues that are being sent out. So let's open this one up. I hope you are all doing well, getting ready for the holidays. I am trying. <laughs> all right, Baker Gerard Confucian opened his bakery in 1840, the oldest known recipe. Okay, all right, let's see what this is. Opening it up. Oh, <laughs> I love these stroop waffles. In fact, I'm making a cup of tea right now as I am recording this. I love stroop waffles. So these are mini stroop waffles. And if you don't know what a stroop waffle is, it's two cookies with a thin layer of caramel in the middle. Now, when you make them bigger, uh, what they do is you make your cup of tea or your cup of cocoa or coffee, and then you set the stroop waffle on top and the heat from the coffee or the tea melts the uh, caramel on the inside and makes it nice and gooey and just delicious. Warms up the cookie as if it's almost right out of the oven. So thank you so much for this. Stroop waffles are one of my most favorite cookies ever. All right, so thank you so much, Roxanne and Randy, and thank you all for coming and watching today. To eight, by the way, is my lucky number, and this was a great gift for number eight. So I'll see you tomorrow with day number nine. <laughs> Bye for now.